Yo, it's really wonderful to to have Luach here with us again to uh, help us prepare for Passover, this time looking at some of the Sephardic melodies and Iraqi melodies uh, for Passover. Thank you. And I'm really sorry about all the tech stuff that we had today. So we're going to start off, we're just going to follow in the order of the handout. So there's a tradition where before saying Manishtana, the kids go outside, they close the door, they knock on the door, the parents answer. And I'm just going to read through what the exchange is, and then we're going to actually learn it and practice it. So the kids will say, Tim. I'm sorry, the parents will say, Tim, which means where are you from? And the kids will answer, from Egypt. The parents will say, where are you going? And the kids will answer, to Jerusalem. And then the parents will say, where is your suitcases? And then the kids come in, everyone sits down and reads together the Manishtana. Now, I think in the Ashkenazi tradition, um, it's like individuals read or just the kids read or something. So in the Iraqi tradition, the whole family reads together. So I figure that you're already familiar with the Manishtana passage itself in Hebrew. I'm also going to be chanting it in Judeo-Arabic. So in the Iraqi Jewish tradition, we say the whole Haggadah in two languages. So it goes Hebrew, Judeo-Arabic, Hebrew, Judeo-Arabic, Hebrew, Judeo-Arabic, the whole way through. So keeping in mind, Judeo-Arabic was the translation. So that's basically the equivalent of Americans doing Hebrew, English, Hebrew, English, Hebrew, English. Um, So in the observant communities, the Seder goes super long without even any commentary, you're going till two o'clock in the morning. And that's again, without any discussion. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna teach you how to say this whole passage. And then I would like us to unmute. Is that a possibility that we can unmute for a little bit? So that we can all recite together? We can. Okay, great. So. What I'm going to do is first, while we're muted, we're going to practice and then I'll unmute and we can all do it together in the call and response. So let's go over the words. I'm going to do them one at a time. And I'm going to point to me when it's my turn and I'll point to you when it's your turn. Mnen, Mnen, Jitam, Jitam. So let's say it together. Mnen, Jitam, Mnen, Jitam. Okay, the next one that the kids say, Momosraim, Momosraim. Then the parents will say, Ulwen, Ulwen, Riachin, Riachin. I'm going to put that together. Ulwen, Riachin, Ulwen, Riachin. And then the kids answer, Liru Shalayim, Liru Shalayim. Then the parents say, Wush, wush, zuwaditkum, zuwaditkum. Putting it together, wush, zuwaditkum, wush, zuwaditkum. So now listen, I'm going to go the whole way through and we'll do one sentence at a time. So parents, kids, parents, kids. So I'll say it, then you say it at home. We'll do it one at a time through. Then I'm going to do the whole thing through and then we'll do it together. Okay, so parents, Mnenji tub, Mnenji tub, Momos Raim, Momos Raim, Ulwaria Hain, Ulwaria Hain, Liru Shalaim, Liru Shalaim, Wush the what it come, Wush the what it come. All right, so now I'm going to do the whole thing all the way through, and you can practice it with me. Menenji tum, Momos Rayim, Ulwaria Hain, Liru Shalayim, Wush the Wadatkum. All right, so now if we can unmute and I'll be the parents and the rest of you can be the kids. You ready? Are we unmuted? A few people are unmuted. People are unmuted? Okay, good. A few are unmuted. All right, so again, I'm going to be the parents. You guys are going to be the kids. Menji, 
So I'm going to be the kids and you be the parents. Ready? One, two, three. Mom, what's the name? Liru Shalai. What's the name? Good. Okay. So for those of you who don't know, Judeo-Arabic is a language that combines Hebrew and Arabic. And the one that I am chanting in is the Iraqi dialect. So wherever Jews went after the conquest of ancient Israel, we brought with us the language. So most people are familiar with Yiddish, which is a combination of Hebrew, Polish, mm -hmm. Russian, and German. A lot of people are also familiar with Ladino, which is a combination of Hebrew and Spanish. Wherever Jews went, so in Iran, it's Judeo-Farsi. In, in uh, Arabic-speaking countries, it's Judeo-Arabic. Um, so, so we have so many different languages that people aren't even aware of. Beth HaTfutzot is a museum in Israel that's a great resource about all of these different languages from around the world. All right, now we're going to move into Manishtana. And the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to teach you the refrain at the end of the Judeo-Arabic portion. So if we could please uh, mute this section. And what happens is first we, we go through the passage, Hebrew, Arabic, Hebrew, Arabic, Hebrew, Arabic. So there's four uh, passages that it's broken down into. And at the very end of the passage, the meaning is, and on this night we recline. And for the Judeo-Arabic part, we all lean to our left and we waggle our right finger in the air, like, ha ha, you tried to enslave us, but now we're free and we're reclining and we're in a state of luxury, so we won. So I'm gonna teach you the Judeo-Arabic part. Once we learn that, I'm gonna sing for you the Hebrew part. It's too much to teach in one sitting. But I'd like you to just listen because it's a repetitive chant. So you might actually just pick it up more or less, just listening to me. And then we're going to go through the Hebrew, Judeo-Arabic, Hebrew, Judeo-Arabic. And at the very end, we'll sing together this passage and waggle our fingers in the air. So these are the words. I'm going to say it all first, then break it down. Wazilela kilitna mintikiyin. So I'm going to do the first word and then you repeat it. Wazilela, Wazilela, Kilitna, Kilitna, Mintikayin, Mintikayin. Okay, I'm going to do it again one word at a time. Wazilela, Wazilela, Kilitna, Kilitna, Mintikayin. Mintikayin. Okay, now I'm going to do the whole sentence. Wazilela kilitna mintikayin. Wazilela kilitna mintikayin. One more time without the melody, and then I'll add the melody. Wazilela kilitna mintikayin. Wazilela kilitna mintikayin. So now I'm going to sing the melody for you. Wazilela kilitna mentikiyin. I'm going to break it down. First word. Wazilela. Together. Wazilela. Okay, next word. Kilitna. Kilitna. Third word. Mentikiyin. Mentikiyin. I'm going to put it together now. So I'm going to do one word, add on, add on. The first word only. Wadilela. Wadilela. I'm going back and adding. Wadilela. Kilitna. Wadilela. Kilitna. I'm going back and adding. Wadilela. Kilitna. Mentikayin. Wadilela. Kilitna. Mentikayin. 
We're going to do that three times. I'll say it, then you say it. Just for practice, and then we'll do it together. Last one. Wavilala kelet namen tikiin. Wavilala kelet namen tikiin. Okay, now I'd like to unmute. Let's all do it together. And when you're saying it, you lean to the left and waggle your finger in the air. So let me know when we're unmuted, please. Some people are unmuted. Okay. So ready? Here we go. Let's do that. Two more times so you get it embedded in your mind, and then we'll go through the whole Mahishtana. Last time. Good. All right. If you could please mute everybody again. I'm going to go through the whole Manishtana. And um, I'm just going to do the Hebrew first so you can hear what it is. And then if you're able to, you can jump in with me when I do that part. Manishtana halayla haze mekola halelot shebechola halelot en anomatabelin afilupa amehad we halayla haze shetepe amim shebechola halelot anochrin hameso masa we halayla haze kulo masa shebechola halelot anochrin shearierakot Okay, so that's the Hebrew. I'd like us to stay muted. And I'm going to go through, and this time when I go through, I'm going to do it in the traditional way, which is Hebrew, then Arabic, then Hebrew, then Arabic, all the way through. I'm going to pause at the very last section of the Judeo-Arabic so that we can all go um, <clears throat> Actually, why don't you unmute so that we can all do it together at that last section. I'm gonna go ahead and um, start singing in the meanwhile. Okay. All right. Next, we are going to do Dianu. Okay. So everybody knows the word Dianu, but just in case, let's go ahead and practice it. So one, two, three, Dianu. Now, the tune in the Iraqi tradition is Dianu. So let's try that. Dianu. 
So for each passage that I'm going to sing, you go, Diane. All right, so we're going to start. I'd like everyone to be unmuted. And we're going to start um, with something that I did not catch before that looks a little funky in the Hebrew. So in case it's confusing, let's just focus on the chorus of Dayenu. So here we go. Together. Together. Now, before we get into Judeo Arabic, you may notice that my pronunciation of the Hebrew letters is a little bit different than what you're used to. So, Hebrew originated in the Middle East, it's a Semitic language, and Jews who stayed in the Middle East continue to speak languages in their day-to-day -day life that were compatible with the sounds of the original Hebrew. So there was an Aleph, A, ah, and an Ayn, A. Ah. There was a Kaf, K, and a Kof, A. Ah. So when I'm pronouncing the letters, I'm pronouncing the original Hebrew, which a lot of people think sounds like Arabic, and there's a reason for that, which is that they're all Semitic languages. So they have very similar sounds. All right. Now we're going to learn the Judeo-Arabic uh, chorus for Dayeno. So the words are Ben Ikfana. So pronounce after me one letter, one word at a time. Kan. 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 Yikfana. 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 Let's put it together. Kan Yikfana. Kan Yikfana. Good, let's do that two more times. Kanik fun. Kanik fun. Kanik fun. Kanik fun. Good. So the tune is Kanik fun. Good, again. Kanik fun. Kanik fun. Good time. Can you find a can you find a good? So I'm going to go through the Judeo Arabic and you come together with me for can you find a look on a talent a la mala home? Well, I'm stuck in a la el bacher. Lukan Shaklina Ella El Bahar Walam Abana Fiwasto Bilyas Lukan Abana Fiwasto Bilyas Walam Adana Fiwasto Kanik Lukan Abana Fiwasto Bilyas Walam Adana Fiwasto 
كان يكفانا لو كان غاغا قدنا في وسطه ولا نكف عوزنا بالبرا بعين سنة كان يكفانا لو كان كف عوزنا بالبرا بعين سنة ولا متعبنا إلا المن كان يكفانا لو كان تعبنا إلا المن ولا معتلنا إلا إسد كان يكفانا لو كان عتلنا إلا إسد ولا قربنا قدم جبا سيناي كان يكفانا لو كان قربنا قدم جبا سيناي ولا معتلنا إلا التورة كان يكفانا لو كان عتلنا إلا التورة ولا ذخنا لبلاد إسرائيل كان يكفانا لو كان ذخنا لبلاد إسرائيل ولا بنا لنا إلى بيت المقدس كان يكفانا Good job. All right. If you could now be muted for a minute. All right. How are we doing on time? Can someone tell me how we're doing on time? I don't know what time we're supposed to be finished. Oh, well, we said about an hour. So where are we now? Half hour in. Half hour in? Okay. So I think we're good. All right. Now, this is a song that when I've taught it live, I have everybody be the rhythm. So we're going to try that. Um, I'm not sure if it might be a little too chaotic to do it unmuted. So we're going to try it muted. But the rhythm is... Hold on a minute, I gotta switch over to here. Okay, so the rhythm is So a lot of the passages in the Haggadah, um, when we were talking about what to do for this program, a lot of the passages, unlike in other holidays, are a little too complicated to teach in one quick sitting. So some of them we're gonna be chanting when there's choruses that I could break down easily. And some of them it's gonna be more, you can participate as the rhythm section while I'm singing the actual passage. So for this one, I'm gonna go through one time, just sing it and I'd like you just to listen. And then I'm gonna invite you at home just to clap along. We can also try it unmuted, but I'm not sure if it's gonna to be too chaotic. So here's how it goes. Allah hat kama wa kama to ba kafula wa mkhupele dhna ma qom aleno hosiyano ma masraim asabahim shifatim asabilohim harag be khorehim nathan lano wath ba monam qar alano wathayam he abrano be thokho be haraba shiqa sar eno be thokho sitaq Sarchenu bamid bara baim shana he chilanu ethaman nathalanu etha shabbat qer banu lifne har sinai nathalanu etha Torah he chnisanu leeres Israel u banalanu et peda bechira lechapel al kol amono sehenu. So I'm going to suggest we try it unmuted. It may be a little chaotic, but it'll also be fun. So let me know when we're unmuted, please. Two people are unmuted. Okay, here we go. So the rhythm is this.
Now I'm going to sing it in Judeo Arabic. If we could please mute again. Allahumma <laughs> دعمنا إلا المن عطلنا إلا السب قربنا قدم جبال سيناء عطلنا إلا التورة ذخلنا لبلاد إسرائيل وبنا لنا ثلاث بث مقتيل يجفر على جميع ذنوبنا. So there are two sounds in Judeo Arabic that are not in Hebrew. One is the. So there's a dagesh on top of the dalid, a dot on top of the dalid, and the other is ja. So there's a dagesh on top of the gimel. Um, now the Yemenites, when they're pronouncing Hebrew, they also have a ja, but for us, it's just in the Judeo-Arabic. All right, I'd like, just in the interest of time, uh, let's see. Yeah, okay, let's do now the Hillel sandwich. So the Hillel sandwich uh, in the Iraqi tradition is made out of the masa or the matzah, um, obviously the upper and the lower layers. Then you have for the maror, it's romaine lettuce. So that's very different than the horseradish in the Ashkenazi tradition. And the um, haroset that we have is called halek. So it's like H-A-L-E-Q, halek. And it's made out of date syrup and chopped nuts. Now, traditionally you would boil the dates and then you would, um, mash the dates so all the juice gets out, you throw away the pulp, you boil the juice and it becomes a thick syrup and then you add the chopped nuts. Very labor intensive. And that's what we did throughout my childhood with my mom and my sister. Nowadays, you can just go to Whole Foods, get some date syrup in the baking section, throw in some chopped nuts and you're done. So very easy to make the halek if you'd like to try it this year. So again, the Hillel sandwich is you have the upper and the lower piece of the masa. You have the romaine lettuce, and then you have the halak. Now, when you have that sandwich all put together, you dip it into the bowl of the halak, and you recite this passage. And I'm going to sing it to you first, and then I'm going to teach you the end. Just like when we did, this also at the end has a fun twist that I'm going to teach you how to say. So it goes like this. And here comes the fun part. And with that, you lean over to your left and you eat the sandwich. So we're going to learn that last part. So I'm going to break it down one more at a time. Al masoth, al masoth. Next word, umrorim, umrorim. Next word, yochelu, yochelu. Who, who? Okay, let's do that again. Al masoth, al masoth, umrorim. Umrorim, yochelu, yochelu, hu, hu. Last time with single words. Al masoth, al masoth, umrorim, umrorim, yochelu, yochelu, hu, hu. Now I'm gonna put it together in a string. Al masoth. Umrorim. Let's do that. Al masoth umrorim. I'm going back to the beginning. I'm going to add on. Listen first. Al masoth umrorim yochelu hu. Al masoth umrorim yochelu hu. Now I'm going to do the whole thing. Listen first. Al masoth umrorim yochelu hu. 
al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Two more times. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Last time. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Now I'm going to add the tune and the rhythm. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. Together. Al masot umrorim yochelu hu. All right, now if you could please unmute. Tell me when we're unmuted. <clears throat> and I'm unmuted. going to uh, sing the Hillel sandwich. All right. Masa umaror belo beracha zechen la mechdash beyameno yechodash behanel hazaken or Hamwe Ochlem Bebatha Lekaye Mashne Emar together. Alma Good job. All right. I'd like to now skip number six and go to number seven. I don't have that. You don't have one. I don't have the uh, readout of things. They had passed out. What? If you can get to it, there's a link in the chat that you can click on. Can you open the chat? Then you can see the um, the handout. Oh, okay. I'm going to try. Something happened. I... Um... I was looking at this on my phone. It was all perfect. And something weird happened when I printed it out, which I did not know until right now. So I am actually going to go to the chat too. Or you know what? Hold on a minute. I'm going to get my book just because it's going to be easier. Zoom with Kazoom. Step la. Step la. Shetaha. All right, so there's actually an entire book of songs from the Iraqi tradition. This is how many songs we have. This is just songs. This is not the prayer passages. All right, so I'm going to teach you the uh, chorus for this song, Melech Goel, and then we can all sing it together. So let's go over the words first. Please put me on mute. Okay, we're at, it's song number seven on the sheet. Right. So we're gonna go um, one word and then add on. So, Hodu, Hodu, I'm gonna go back to the beginning and add. Hodu la'el, Hodu la'el, Hodu la el ki. Hodu la el ki. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem rosh. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem. Rosh. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem rosh hodashim. Hodu la el ki ha hodesh haze lachem rosh 
Chodashim. We're going to do that two more times the whole thing through. So listen first. Hodu la'el ki ha'chodesh haze lachem rosh chodashim. Hodu la'el ki ha'chodesh haze lachem rosh chodashim. Last time. Hodu la'el ki ha'chodesh haze lachem rosh chodashim. Hodu la'el ki Hodesh Haze Lachem Rosh Hodashim. All right, so now I'm going to add the melody. So it goes like this I'm going to sing the whole chorus through first, and then I'm going to break it down for you. Hodula Eliki Hafo Deshahaze Lachem. I'm going to sing it two more times just by myself so you can get acclimated to it and then we'll break it down. Last time. Last time. So now I'm going to break it down for you. First word, hodu, together, hodu. I'm going to go back to the beginning and add on. Hodu la el, hodu la el, hodu la el ki, hodu la el ki. Hodu la eleki ha. 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 Desh. Hodu la eleki ha ho desh. Hodu la eleki ha ho desh hazem. Hodu la eleki ha ho desh hazem. Hodu la eleki ha ho. Oh, <laughs> Deshazelachem <laughs> All right, so I'm going to sing it three times the whole way through with you repeating after me, and then I'd like to unmute when we do it all together. So listen first. Together. My cat is doing her shenanigans. Together. Last time. 
ho du na el ki ha ho te shahzel achem rosh hodashim together ho du na el ki ha ho te shahzel achem rosh hodashim so please tell me when we're unmuted and we'll do it all together. Unmuted. Okay, great. And go. Good. All right. So I'm going to sing from the top and I'll indicate to you when it's the chorus and we all sing together. Please leave it unmuted. Melech goel o moshia el naros besod qadoshim wal an on him smayar be mahazik rifion yedrashim ki yom libe hodeshabim bene I'm so in the song I forgot. Okay. <clears throat> Beshir is a mara with a he la bishalosh kit of Mahanaim. After all, the Alamasol Oh, <laughs> Mythobosas bedamo. Dama pesahawedamamila. Azaya barumi asmo. Demos raim weda mo si me abadutale ho fashim. Together? Ashur <laughs> Ashurim awulatoshim. Wetachni agyon zaharim. 
ושלח עליה מלך הדורשים, האדון אשר מבחשים, פניס על ראש החודשים. הודו I'd like to um, <clears throat> see if there are any questions, mostly because my voice is petering out on me. So I'd like to just take a little break if anyone would like to ask some questions now. No questions, okay. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> um, let's move on to the next song. I'm gonna teach you the chorus. So we'll do the words first. Uh, please mute. Okay, first word, pare. Pare. Oh. Next word, nisan. Nisan. So I'm gonna do that whole line. Pare, nisan. Pare, nisan. Okay, the next line, the first word, berach, together. Berach, nisan. Nisan. I'm going to do that whole line. Berach, Nissan. Berach, Nissan. Okay? The third line is the same as the first. Harem Nissan. Harem Nissan. The fourth line. Dar me'oni. Dar me'oni. Fifth line. Am Kadoshi. Am Kadoshi. Sixth line. Neman Oran. Neman Oran. Last line. Hazrah Koni. Hazrah Koni. I'm going to go back to the beginning and we're going to do one line at a time. Hare Nisan. Hare Nisan. Berah Nisan. Berah Nisan. Harem Nisan. Harem Nisan. Dar Meoni. Dar Meoni. Am Kadoshi. Am Kadoshi. Neeman Oran. Neeman Oran. Hazrah Koni. Hazrah Koni. We're going to do that one line at a time, one more time. Hare Nisan. Hare Nisan. Berah Nisan. Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni, Dar Meoni, Am Kadoshi, Am Kadoshi, Neman Oran, Neman Oran, Hazrah Koni, Hazrah Koni. Now we're going to go back to the beginning and I'm going to add it so we keep like building blocks adding on. Harem Nisan, Hare Nisan, going back to the beginning. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan. Back to the beginning. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan. Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni, Am Kadoshi. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni. Am Kadoshi. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni, Am Kadoshi, Neaman Oran. Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni, Am Kadoshi, Neaman Oran. Now the full thing, Hare Nisan, Berah Nisan, Harem Nisan, Dar Meoni, 
عن قدوشي نعمان اوران هزره قوني هارم نيسان بيرح نيسان هارم نيسان دار معوني عن قدوشي نعمان اوران هزره قوني So now I am going to um, <clears throat> put all that with the melody. I am out of water. I just need to refill for my voice. I'll be right back. All right, so now we're going to put it together with the melody. <clears throat> together. Now I'm going to do something we call alucha. Alucha is like taffy. So a lot of Middle Eastern music is, and that's just one syllable, one note. So Hare Nisan, Hare Nisan, Hare Nisan, Bera, Hare Nisan, Bera, Hare Nisan, Bera, Hare Nisan, Again, there's the alucha. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan. Hare Nisan. Bear <laughs> We're going to do that one again. Listen first. Okay, so that's the first half we have down so far. <clears throat> I'm going to now do the second half. Darmeani, back to the beginning of that. Darmeani, I'm quick. Darmeani, I'm quick. Darmeani, I'm Darmeani, Again, that same passage. Darmeani, I'm Kedoshim. Darmeani, I'm Kedoshim. Darmeani, I'm Kedoshim. Neeman, Darmeani. I'm Kedoshim Neman 
در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن هزرح در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن هزرح Almost done. در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن حزرح قانی در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن حزرح قانی Listen again. در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن حضر حقانی در معانی هم قدوشیم نعمن آرن حضر حقانی Okay, I'm going to do the whole thing now from the beginning of the chorus through there. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan, Hare Menisan, Dara Me'oni, Am Qadoshim, Nemanoran, Hazrahani. So now I want you to do that. And I'll sing with you. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan, Hare Menisan, Dara Me'oni, Am Qadoshim, Neman Oran, Hazrahani. So I know this is the most complex of any of the passages that I've taught you to date in any of our time together. So let's do this one two more times back and forth. So I'll sing first. Hare Nisan, Bera Hanisan, Hare Menisan, Dara Me'oni, Am Qadoshi, Together. 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 Okay, last time, listen first. Together last time. Mm -hmm. Never 
Good. Okay. Now we're going to go from the top. Please let me know when you're unmuted. Unmute. Okay. So I will point to you when it's time for the course. song i'm proud of you so we've gone quite a bit over time so that's it for today i have some announcements for you um you may be familiar with the band iowa they combine yemenite jewish prayer with um like hip-hop reggae different kind of dance grooves and uh they're going to be on the cover of the 2021 edition of my book the Flying Camel, Essays on Identity by Women of North African and Middle Eastern Jewish Heritage. So the book has been out mm. of print for many years. It was published about 20 years ago. So I'm going to be republishing that. You can find it on my hub website, which is kazoom.com, K-H-A-Z-Z-O-M.com. And oh, thank you. <laughs> and uh, if you click on shop, you'll see the book there. Um, I have actually a bunch of things that are about to come out. I have a few albums. Uh, one of them is a, it's called Shaddai, and it is a new age take on sacred Iraqi Jewish chants. Another is Iraqis in pajamas. We combine original alternative rock with Iraqi Jewish prayers. Um, so there's a lot to check out. If you're interested in my work, you can follow me there. You can also follow me on YouTube. I've been doing a series of videos. That's at youtube.com slash chazoom. And you can also follow me anywhere on social media. I primarily post on Facebook, which is facebook.com slash So thank you again for 
uh, bringing us all together for the holiday, and I'd be happy to take any questions now. Yeah, Lola. Um, yeah. So we know what a sort of standard, um, if you will, Ashkenazic Haggadah looks like, and it's got a few songs in the back. Um, it seems like there's a more prolific uh, series of songs in the Sephardic and Iraqi traditions. What do you attribute that to? I'm not sure I understand because can you can you tell me exactly what your what aspect of the Ashkenazi Haggadah you're asking about? I'm saying like in the uh, Haggadah, there's like there's like you know in addition to the the basic of the Haggadah, there's a couple of songs at the end. You know, there's there's uh, right. the Chad Miode and and Chad Gadya and that. It seems like here there's a lot more uh, songs that are either scattered throughout the Haggadah or um, or sort of separate from it, but are used as part of the Seder evening. Got it. Now I understand. Okay. So we have, um, hold on. I'm going to grab my Haggadah. Just a second. Yeah, I noticed a lot of the songs seem like Rosh Chodesh Nisan was very prominent in it. Right. No, 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 no. Uh, a lot of this stuff is in boxes from my mood, right? uh, This is one of the Haggadot that I have. Uh, there are some more old school ones from decades and decades ago. This is about also like 20, 20 30 years ago, actually. But uh, I have some that are, you know, from when I was a kid. And um, so we have in here, these are like the actual Haggadah recitations. So we have in Hebrew and we have in Judeo-Arabic. Now Judeo-Arabic is not actually written in Arabic script. It's written in Hebrew script or traditionally was written in Rashi script. Um, I believe that our Haggadah, and I may be wrong about this, I believe our Haggadah and the Ashkenazi Haggadah are pretty much the same. Uh, what, what I was teaching you was in addition to passages from the Haggadah, I was teaching you uh, songs for Pesach. So this is the book that I have. Again, we have a ton of songs for the various holidays for Shabbat. So that's what I was, the Melech Goel and the Nachor Libo, the last two that we did. Those are from the Book of Songs for Pesach. Now those songs also at the end of our Haggadah. So you can see here's the Melech Goel. It comes at the end and there's the Nachor Libo at the bottom. Okay, and it continues over here. We do have, we do have a Chad Miodeh. Um, a yeah, I can't remember if we have that. I know that my grandfather used to just read the Chad Miodeh. We didn't have that. We didn't have like a special tune. Um, and I don't see a Chad yeah. So that may be, we don't, we don't have that. Yeah, I don't think we have a Chad Gadya. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, I'm sorry, we've got it. Who has it? What's up with the Yiddish? There's a Ladino. Ladino? Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, we, I didn't realize it was on. We, uh, we've we sung and learned that a, a Ladino Echad Mio Dea and a Yiddish Mio Dea. So I'm sorry to hear it's done also in Jew. Dea. No, no, no. We do have that one. What I was saying is, it, no. I, don't think we have a, I don't think we have a Had Gadya. Yeah. No, well, I don't. not surprising. That's German. Oh, is it? <laughs> I mean, it's based well, on a German song, yes. Okay, I remember I really liked it in Hebrew school. That was a fun song. Um, so yeah, so those songs that I taught you, they're like at the end. They're, they're kind of, they're the holiday songs. They're more like supplementary, but they are in the Haggadah, but they're not like the official Haggadah. They come at the end. Also, uh, we call it the Shatacha. That's like the Iraqi way of pronouncing it, Shatacha, um, in addition to calling it the Haggadah. Any other song? Any other questions? One of the things, if you uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, I'm about to do a video recording of um, songs that I've taken from the Haggadah and I've combined with original alternative rock and personal storytelling. So the Menanji Tim is actually in one of the songs. And if you stay tuned to my YouTube channel, you'll see I'm going to be uh, recording and sharing that this week. Another song. Um, that we didn't do today um, is one of my favorite passages, and it's Abit 
كنا لفرعون في مصر وخرجنا الله لهنا من تا بيد شديدة وبدعم ممدودة and I took that passage and I combined it with a um, you know very political commentary which I will not say anything about so you have to you have to be surprised um, when you tune into that um, but if you're interested in kind of a contemporary stamp on it um, I love I love the passages from the Haggadah and from the time I was a very little girl um, you know I used to learn them every Shabbat and I was very proud of myself when I was about 14 and I was suddenly able to lead it all by myself so it used to be when I was growing up, I would poop out on the couch, you know, somewhere midway. And then as I got older, my parents started pooping out on the couch and I continued to do the whole thing all the way to the end. Any other questions? Well, thank you very much, Lola. You're welcome. It was my pleasure as always. Thank you. Thanks to Yvonne thank for you. helping to organize. And uh, everybody, uh, hope this helps to uh, elevate us for our Pesach this year. Amen. Amen. Bye. Bye.